Welcome to our third edition of Seafood Industry News. On average, 17% of business costs are related to purchasing juvenile oysters or seed stock. A seafood CRC project comparing over 40 oyster businesses shows these costs can reach 53% if a business is purchasing larger, older juvenile oysters to grow out or if spat mortalities are high. The Sydney Rock Oyster Breeding Program has helped deliver QX disease resistant oysters. These oysters have significantly increased survival during QX outbreaks as well as faster growth rates leading to reduction in time to market of up to 12 months. Further genetic gains are expected as the breeding program shifts to family selection through the creation of 60 family lines using new pair mating protocols. A link between QX resistance and certain marker genes has been identified. This creates the potential for further enhancing QX resistance through marker-assisted selection. By 2014, the National Oyster Industry Plan aims to increase industry production to 20 million dozen oysters, net profit by 10%, and industry gross value of production to $120 million per year. Don't miss the Seafood CRC Project Information Lounge at AA2010. Have a meeting, check your emails, chat to staff, or relax and catch up with the latest research. For more information on these stories, visit our website at seafoodcrc.com. <laughs>